What's going on guys, Nate Gould here, uh, bringing you a beautiful little gameplay on Nuketown. I was playing the PlayStation Network Nuketown playlist, but we'll get back to that in a second. First thing I want to talk about is that this is my third video here for the Movement Community Channel, which if you don't know by now, you're a fool, but they are a community channel where they feature your video and, you know, for a day you're the top of the list, but you stay in their featured videos. So every time someone goes to their page, they can see you and you can get your name out there and, and get some more subs and make some new friends and love and candy and joy and all that goodness. So I posted this video because I do drop 100 kills. Spoiled it, I know. And um, I think it's probably one of the first games I've seen on the movement with 100 kills. I don't know if there's more left. I can't say I've seen every single movement video. You know, I'm a busy man, but I do watch most of them. And I don't know. I don't know if any more have, but I think this is probably one of the first ones. And one of the most beautiful and I got I played this game two days ago over the weekend during the um, Newtown 24-7 playlist with double experience that was on the PlayStation I guess because um, you know PlayStation didn't get the map pack so you know they want to do something nice for them even though I do have Xbox and I did get the map pack but I want to play some PlayStation so I did uh, I was really pleased that this was like I don't know, this weekend or this night, this morning, it was like 6 in the morning, whatever you want to call it. Uh, the connections were going really good all night. I don't know if I was pulling holes, blah, 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 pulling holes or if it was the playlist because it was a small map or I don't know. I have no clue, but uh, the connections were really good. It, it's the first time I played on PlayStation where it felt like Xbox, and it shows because I dropped 100 kills. So, so I figured what I'd talk about today is me. Because this is going to be on a channel where uh, you don't know me and some a lot of newcomers will be coming in and stuff like that. So I'm just talking about myself. Uh, obviously my name is Nate Gould. I do a show on YouTube called Nate Gould's VGT, which stands for Video Game Talk, where I talk about video games. And I'm 20, I go to college for uh, security, like hardware security and like encrypting and stuff like that. But I haven't started any of those classes yet. I haven't gotten to my bachelor's. I probably will be in a few more months, so... Uh, you know, that's pretty much me. That's all I'm going to say about me. I don't want to get too personal. I don't need any stalkers or anything like that, but... Now, let's talk about my channel. My channel is in the description, so please check it out. Subscribe to it if you love it, if you love this video. Uh, what I post, I post like a variety of things. I did have a schedule, but I changed it now. I do have one Medal of Honor gameplay, Uncharted, which now that I have my PlayStation hooked up, I'm probably going to get the other one up this week. I'm probably going to do another Middle of Honor because I have about six of those saved in my Xbox. Uh, I post Black Ops PS3 and Black Ops Xbox 360 gameplays. Uh, I'm picking up World at War soon, probably with this month. And um, I'm just going to try to get like a used Call of Duty 4 and World at War for like 30 bucks. So I'm going to start posting those. But I just want to post a variety of stuff. I am doing Halo Reach, but I'm not the best Halo Reach player. So I have a couple guys I'm going to feature some of their videos and probably do a dual com. Actually, he was up on this channel, Almerda. I'll probably I'm gonna try to get a feat a game from him this week to feature. Maybe dual call, maybe just have him do it. I don't care. But so I, those is pretty much what I post. Uh, I have a shout out series every Sunday where I shout out my subs. But I don't just shout out every sub. If, if you take the time to come to me and submit a 30 second clip with a two to four minute description of your video you uh, you get the shout out and I only do it that way is because if someone subs to me for like a, I don't know if I sub to someone and they sub to me as you know out of courtesy but they're not watching or something like that I don't you know I'm only shouting out the people who are gonna take the time who watch my videos who I know watch my videos because you know I see their comments and stuff like that and they're gonna come to me so they see my videos and hear about it and uh, those are the people I you know I sub but that's every Sunday those come out but every Sunday those come out road rage and um, they're pretty awesome. I'll, I've already got like four or five submissions for the fifth one, so it should be a really big one this week. I, you know, I'm really hoping it is. I, I just want it to be big enough where I have to two-part it. That would just be like uh, pretty awesome. Because this is a new channel. I can't make 15-minute vids yet, or more than 15 minutes. So if we have to two-part it, we shall. Jeez, we're not even at six minutes yet. This is a long video. But Also, what I'm doing is a 100 win streak and sabotage. I have the first 22 games recorded. 15 and 16 are going up now. There was a little break in between just because uh, I had some crazy audio issue. One day when I recorded my capture card, I apparently was being extremely horrible. So, unfortunately, I have to keep them though because it, it's the proof for the 
it's the proof of the wins. The, you know, I have to be able to show every win of the hundreds. And uh, I just changed it where I'm just doing the hundred win streaks. I'm not doing it by the numbers. I'm just going to document every hundred wins because I'm trying to get to my 14th prestige. And this was a good weekend to get up. I got to like a 40 on my 12th. Uh, and then I started playing, you know, PS3 so I can get to my... I went On Sunday I went from a, uh, what was it, 35 to a 48 doing the double experience in Newtown. So... Um, that probably would have been like a 35 my 13th prestige having playing Xbox. But I didn't, so. I did play a little bit of Xbox, so we changed up the way we're doing it. But they're up there. They're going up there. And then, you know, I got 15 to 22 going up. I got 15 and 16 probably going up. Um, today's the 7th, so you probably won't even see it. I'll probably be on like game 30 by the time this is on the movement. But they're up there and they're going up there. So check those out. Let's see what else we should talk about here. Um, let's talk about this game. What are we doing in this game? This is the headquarters of me running and gunning. I'm not playing. I'd probably say I'm playing flanker, but there's not really spawns in, set spawns in headquarters. So more so just a main slayer. I'm just running around and uh, having a good time. I'm using scavenger, sleight of hand, and hacker unpro, but sleight of hand scavenger are pro. I'm using the FAMAS with extended mags. And I was... Oof, I love this gun. FAMAS is my... It's probably a tie for second. Uh, yeah, we captured the headquarters, but it's probably tied for second with my assault rifles. Because uh, number one's the commando. I mean, that's just it. And then it's kind of like the AK and the FAMAS. They're usually, I'm kind of like, my skill level with them is pretty equal. I've, I have really good games with both of them. And I'm really comfortable with both of them. But, you know, if I'm having a day where I'm not shooting so great and I need to switch guns. And I'm using the AK. If I switch to the Moss, I'm good. You know, so they're kind of like my standings for each other. They're right at the same level if I need them. They're my my best running gun guns. Running gun guns, running gun guns. So I, you know, I use them a lot. But I don't have the AK yet. So I wanted to post this as well, or also whatever I'm trying to say, on the movement because I actually recorded a. I think I have. Jeez, what do I have? Four or five other Newtown games from Sunday from the uh, Newtown 24 7 playlist. So I'm going to make a playlist on YouTube called Newtown 24 7 and I'm going to throw it up there. So I figured I'd put this on the movement because it'll be on both channels because you upload to your channel and then, you know, they put it on your channel. So I figured I'd put this one on the movement. So if you guys saw it and you want to see more uh, running and gunning gameplay, uh, you can come and check out the playlist and, you know, and do this. So that's pretty much it for the game. I go... I forgot to hit the scoreboard because I was actually... Uh, what's it called? What was I, doing? I don't know. I was doing something. I think I was doing homework when I was recording. So I wasn't paying attention. And I ran over. So I didn't actually get the scoreboard. But I get 100 kills. I get my 100th kill right at the last second. Um, and it was nerve-wracking. I mean, literally, it's like... I spawn. There's 10 seconds left. It's like 3, 2, kill, 1, game over. So, I just got the 100, which was nice. That's not my highest so far. My highest kills are 113 on Xbox, but this is definitely my highest for PlayStation. And it's actually the highest kill game I p I'm posting on YouTube, because my first one, my 113 one, uh, I sat with FAMAS. Yeah, I did it with the FAMAS, with extended mags. I just kind of sat by, if you're on the left side from where I am right now, where B is, I kind of sat behind those boxes and just spawn killed. And even though it was kind of cool when it was in the first week of Call of Duty, and, and it was awesome, but it just wasn't as interesting to me, you know? I really did just sit there and spawn camp. I didn't move a lot. They couldn't really touch me, so... I never posted it. I never even saved it. It was just kind of like, whatever. Oh, sorry, I had a burp. Alright, so we're coming up, running up on like 90 minutes here, so let's talk about this movement some more. This lovely channel of movement. Let's, first of all, let's go through the directors because not only do they feature your videos and then you know they're put up on their front channel they also have a director for each day minus Sunday <coughs> and that's not an accident it's not that they can't find directors it's Sunday's kinda like their extra days for you know updates and open lobbies and things like that so they do different things uh, more community based as a Sunday or as a Sunday first Sunday so they don't have a director for that day now, um, let me talk about why I just had a sniper rifle there. Well, that guy was camping, so you saw me try to go up top to kill him. 
And then I meant to pick my FAMAS class, and I picked my Cyber class, and I was like, shit. So I just kind of, you know, tried dealing with the hand that was given to me and that I stupidly picked for myself. And I got a hit marker and died, and it was game. So now back to these directors. So there is Sir Bill Keys 9. He is on Monday. I'm going to try to reset the entire schedule. If I get it wrong, I don't care. Then on Tuesday, there's Navy Boy 92. Then Wednesday is Incredible Orm, who's new. He's just replacing Big Country. Well, actually, by the time you see this, like I said again, it'll probably be a couple of weeks. So you'll probably have seen a couple of Incredible Orbs. Awesome Wednesday. He's Swedish. It's kind of funny. He's like, he's like Taves 2.0. I actually, I like uh, Incredible Morb. Uh, la, 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 Incredible Morb. Incredible Orb more than Taves. I don't know why. Maybe it's just the way the accent is. I just don't, I don't know. Tape gets kind of annoying. It, like, you can't listen to tape forever. It gets kind of annoying, but, like, Incredible Orb has the Rush to Commander. I can listen to that all day. You know, no homo, but it's just what it is. I like his I like his Swedish voice better, so. Wednesday is the Incredible Orb with his Wednesday. Awesome Wednesday is what he's calling it. Then Thursday, I believe, is Link 10 10 3. Then Friday is Saf, Unlucky Saf. And Saturday is Johnny B. Yeah, I think those are right. Maybe Link and Saf are switched. I don't think so, though. I'm pretty sure um, Link is on Thursday. I know J Johnny B is on Saturday. I don't know. Something like that. M Link or Saf might be switched, but those are the schedules. And they post all, cra all, all kinds of crazy stuff. They got... What's it called? Uh, they got wrestling. There's been some Call of Duty. They all, one week, they all posted WrestleMania on accident. That was kind of funny. I think Bill Keys did Street Fighter this week. He's did, um, I don't know. They just do a bunch of classic games, a bunch of craziness. So it's really funny. Uh, we're rounding up here, guys. Um, you know, this game's awesome. Chopper Gunners are sweet. I really wish I would have hit the scoreboard more. You know, but like I said, I was doing homework, so I wasn't really paying attention. So, I don't know. Oh, and finally, the last thing I want to talk about. I can't believe it's even slipped my mind. It was all night zombies that me, uh, Link Ten Ten Three, and Mr. Nappy Boy Ninety Two, on you know the directors of this channel that we all support so much, uh, we all post on this channel called All Night Zombies, which was created by Nappy Boy. And I have a, I have some Ascension gameplay. Cause I'm the only one with Xbox. Uh, they're getting they have World at War. There's you know. There's a Tricom of us doing Kino and Black Ops. There's a little bit of everything of us just having a good time and stuff like that. At this point, I only have two live comms. I'm about to do one. Um, you know, Link does this does this thing where he just plays with noobs. It's called, I don't know what he calls it, but he just runs around with a bunch of, like, random people and, like, revives them 50 times and does all this craziness. And he, like, carries them around 12 and he ballistic knifes all of them. And, you know, he does, like, this ridiculous stuff. He does it in everything. Uh, I think he has one on his channel for uh, Black Ops, and he has a couple for World at War, and it's just really funny. So he wants me to do that for Ascension, because he thought that would be funny. And it's, you know, I, I got a good one lined up. I might try to do a live com one, but I have a good one saved if it doesn't work out for the live com. That it's like round 12. I have 12,000 points, 285 kills, and like 15 revives. So that could be the perfect game. So I don't know, but I'm going to start doing that on Ascension where I just join a bunch of randoms and try to carry them as far as I can. And I'm going to try to get my highest streak going. I haven't hit 20 yet just because every time, you know, me and my brother try to find someone to play with, they suck. We play with his friend and he's just really selfish and doesn't watch the windows. And he's always trying to hit his box and do this and do that for him. And, you know, I hate playing zombies with people like that. That's why it's really upsetting that Nappy Boy and Link don't have PS3 or, or don't have Xbox or that um the maps you know take longer to go on ps3 but the maps are awesome i do have a game uh, i do have a gameplay i'll probably get a few more from the new map pack so you can go check those out and uh we can just have a good time check out my channel check out the movements channel if you're on my channel and you haven't subbed to it and uh just show everyone some support because you know they have a lot of people out they've gotten me some subs they've gotten you know they, they've helped me They've helped me become the, the commentator I am today and build the channel where it is. So check them out and uh, sub to them. If you're not subbing to me, sub to me. Drop a like or a favorite. Get some support. 
you know get you know get the channel's name out there and everything and 